<laughs> I don't usually like to make a personal comment about somebody who's already dead. Think, what did I do? I designed a phone. If you did not design it, Koreans would have done it. You tell me, is it important that you are a pleasant and wonderful human being? So this question comes from Rim. He says that Steve Jobs was said to have a bad temperament. He often subjected his employees to profanity, fired them in public and push pushed them to the extreme limits of performance. He is also considered one of the greatest innovators of our time. Is such behavior justified as long as one delivers results? <laughs> uh, I don't usually like to make a personal comment about somebody who's already dead, okay? But uh, I'm asking you, one thing is what we do, another thing is what kind of human beings we are. Is it important what kind of human being you are? Hello? Yes. I did something, what did I do? I designed a phone. If you did not did a design it, Koreans would have done it, Chinese would have done it, Indians also beginning to do it. Yes or no? There is a certain brand building process in the world with which you can build a brand. And see, I want you to understand, you're a doctor, at least on the way. Does this body need oxygen or carbon dioxide? Oxygen. Oxygen. But people pumped carbon dioxide into your bottle and said the real thing. Coca-Cola. It's the largest brand on the planet, all right? More people drink, at least all these years, more people drank Coca-Cola than people did yoga or people did anything else. In the remotest part of this country, if you went twenty years ago, if you uttered the word yoga, they didn't know what it was. But if you said Coca-Cola, they knew what it was. So just because it's branded like this and marketed like this, does it become that your system has become such it likes carbon dioxide and doesn't like oxygen, is it so? No. So you can brand things in so many ways, you don't go by these things. You tell me, is it important that you are a pleasant and wonderful human being? Is it important for you? Otherwise, you look at it the other way around. Do you like to be shouted at right now? I can shout. You… you like to be shouted at? No. Then why do you think somebody else likes it? Hello? You don't want to be abused, isn't it? Would you like to be abused? Then why do you ever think that somebody else likes it? When you don't like it, you know, it is not nice to you. Why do you do it to this person? Why do you do that? You lost your humanity fundamentally, isn't it? So, just because you made a lot of money, I don't think it means anything. Alexander, the great idiot, conquered half the known world. What does it mean? It doesn't mean a damn thing to me. Only a fool would call such a man as a great man. He just spent his whole life killing people and you call him Alexander the Great? No, they forgot his third name, it was idiot <laughs> So, please do not go by these standards. Somebody has this much money, so he becomes a great man? I don't think so. Anyway, you untimely death with cancer happened, you didn't pack all your money and go, there's no container service in the end. He went to the extent of saying that whatever at that time he had some forty-six billion dollars personal worth, he said, even if I have to use this forty-six billion dollars, every dollar of it, I would like to destroy Google because that is a… they're not making phones, but they have become more prominent in the country. So you want to kill it, even if you lose all your money, there are people like this. 
Even if both my eyes go, I want to take one eye of hers. This is the crudest level of existence as far as I am concerned. <laughs>